Oh, hello guys, on the last video we have seen all the jump instructions and we have used it to determine the uh, largest number between two numbers. So, so we're gonna, we're gonna practice PMO if else uh, type of problem. So in this uh, video we're gonna see we have the problem like suppose A L and B L to register contain extended ASCII characters. This can be anything we can take as input or we can define it anyway it doesn't matter and now what you have to do is display the one that come first in the character sequence suppose if we have uh, a into l and like b into uh, bl so if a come first in the character sequence we will print a if the b comes first in character sequence we'll have to print b so let's begin so firstly so not not taking input just defining like l uh, this is the way of uh, assigning any uh, uh, any character or any uh, number integer without uh, Printing its uh, ASCII number, so easier. We are putting okay, putting two, say two into L and and the line we're moving nine into BL. Now, now we will have to check which one comes first in character sequence. So we have to use that if else condition sorry if else uh, type of thing but here it is a bit different so i have to use that compare line compare al into bl we are comparing a, the value of al with the value of bl now we yeah, have to use jump jump instruction if uh, listen just you can use any type of condition so the condition that popping into my, in my mind is if uh, L is less than BL, then we will print L. That means L is less than BL. That means uh, the, the value of L is uh, comes first in the character sequence. So, jump less than to say, let's say the level one. This is the na name of the level, and this is these two are keywords. We have to use jump if less than then we are defining declaring a level as we all know the way of declaring level the name and semicolon and that's the level okay so the here if al is less than bl then we will jump into this uh, level and here we will print We will print uh, AL, the value of AL, move the value of AL into DL in order to print and int 21 each. And then again, the here you can see if AL is not, if AL is not greater than, sorry, sorry, AL is not less than VL, that means BL is less than AL, that means the value of BL comes first in the character sequence. I'm writing it for you. BL that means AL is not less than BL that means AL is greater than BL so so in that case we'll have to print move H to to print BL that means if BL is smaller then that will come first in the ASCII character sequence so yeah BL int 21H so that's pretty much done. So let's start it. So here you can see. Just let me show the character table. Okay. So here the output is two. The two number we have we, we took on it was uh, nine and two. So if you just look here. So the ASCII ASCII number for two is 50 the ASCII number for nine is 57 so that means 50 
smaller than 57 that means it comes first in the character sequence that's how we can print any number in this ascii table we can just define with this simple if else kind of thing statements with compare and jump instructions okay thank you bye guys see you in the next tutorial